Hey guys, Brandon with Whiskey River Trading. So I'm here for Whiskey River Weekly and uh, this is gonna be a longer one. There's gonna be a pile of good information in here if you're a Whiskey River customer uh, or not. And uh, yeah, so we are on the tail end of the, well, no, November's over. So no more November golden ticket sale, which uh, was very successful in my opinion. I enjoyed uh, and all of us enjoyed throwing stuff into people's orders, especially things that we thought maybe they wouldn't buy for themselves, but we could add to their order uh, with that golden ticket sale. So uh, Black Friday, Cyber Monday shipping's uh, over now. We have gotten pretty much everything shipped out that was ordered, short of some few orders that have a little bit of discrepancies that we need to um, flush out with the customer. But yeah, uh, we got... 120 packages, the last 120 packages out yesterday and got them on the UPS truck. So um, thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who ordered and everyone who um, supported us through the month of November. November is usually a pretty crazy month for us and we wanted to run sales all through the whole month this year and that's a little bit different how we've been doing. So chainsaw giveaway went well, uh, a customer named Greg won it. Uh, Beardy Greg Farmer on Instagram is his handle, actually. He is on Instagram. And uh, looks like he runs a homestead, and I think that sounds going to be perfect for him. So I shipped that out yesterday. That was pretty cool, and I'm excited to see uh, some work that he's done with it. I'm very jealous uh, of that saw, and might be picking one up for myself in the next year. We'll see. Uh, it seems like a good mid-sized saw for getting some firewood work done. So um, we've got another auction up currently live for bidding. The last auction was very successful. A couple touch points on the auction that I wanted to kind of reach out and say, if you're an Apple user, this doesn't really apply to you until we get this app up. And I've been dragging my feet on getting with Apple and the technical team on there. I need to get my button gear and get the Apple app up and going because that's gonna be super helpful. So if you haven't gotten a notification that says that you won something, it's because that you were bidding outside of the app. The app is the one that gives you notifications of like, hey, you lost, or hey, you lost your bid, or you've been outbid, and you know to reply a bid, and then also it lets you know, hey, you just won that thing. So we've had quite a few customers that have been a little confused, like, hey, did I win anything, and how do we bill this and everything? So um, the Apple app's coming. If you're if you have an Android um, or an Android-based tablet, you can download the app on there, and that's going to make it a little bit easier. As far as billing goes, uh, we clerk the auction within 48 hours of it ending. So today it's getting clerked and we send out uh, receipts. Uh, your billing info that is on file with that service is all um, charged. That's how we charge your, uh, your winning bids. And we charge actual shipping on the product. If uh, orders are over $150, you don't pay shipping. And just like on the website, and then we ship it out. Uh, usually takes about three to five days for us to get it out, um, get it packaged up and everything, especially with this auction stuff. It's kind of interesting because it uses different boxes than we normally use with our standard axes. So, um, so yeah, I've been ordering different boxes and, and trying to figure out how to ship a, you know, uh, big double bid or loose heads and stuff. Cause we don't sell you loose heads on the website. So, but yeah, auction has been super successful. We've got another one up for bidding ends in nine days, eight days. Can't remember the ending off the top of my head, but it ends relatively soon. And we're gonna try to do an auction every 10 days um, going forward. So stay tuned for more of that. Um, I can't promise they're all gonna be 30, 40 axes, but they are going to have, um, you know, 20 at least in each one. And I try to throw a variety in to kind of please everybody, whether it's a project axe or it's a, almost a fully restored ax or it is, um, we did some log hammers and some felling wedges in this last one. I hope to do a, a European ax one because this collection does have actually a decent amount of HBs and some European hewing axes, some goose wing hewers and things like that. Stuff that I'm actually not too familiar with because we mostly swing American stuff here since we sell American axes and American styled replacement handles, so. So yeah, that's the auction. Uh, I guess on the next step, because we're rolling right into that, is handles. Uh, the question has been, when are you gonna get handles in next? And 
the November sale uh, kicked our butt. We don't, we've never had handles in for a sale. Like we don't, since that's just never, it's just the timing's never worked out for it. So um, we did have handles in stock and we did drop the 28C as a new product during the golden ticket sale, which was really, really cool um, to see people be able to take advantage of, of the sale, uh, the low free shipping and also the golden ticket uh, for that specific heritage handle. But come uh, mid-December, I'm hoping for the 15th-ish, we're gonna be dropping handles on the website. Now, that's getting really, really close to Christmas. And uh, I guess this is kind of a multifaceted point that I'm trying to make here. One, handles are gonna drop, and then we've got a short amount of time before the 23rd. And on the 23rd, we close down until January 2nd. We're still gonna have the website open and you can still order and everything. It's just that orders won't start getting shipped until the 2nd of January. <clears throat> So December 23rd through the 2nd of January, it's time for us to spend time with our family. It's time for us to do a little bit of inventory inside the warehouse um, after this craziness that we just experienced. Um, so that's the plan. Uh, and so I'm encouraging all of you to put your orders in for Christmas as early as possible. Shipping companies, I can't remember if they've released, I need to look that up if they've released uh, the last day of shipping, but it's usually right around the 18th that, you know, like, if you get something shipped on the 18th of December, there's a really good chance you're gonna get it by Christmas. I always say the 15th, but <clears throat> yeah. So we're gonna be have be pretty heavy in shipping in that short window of opportunity when we uh, do our next handle drop. And in that next handle drop, we have uh, the 28 fallers, we've got 30 Cs. I'm hoping for some more 28 Cs, we'll see. I tuned up the pattern, we'll see if we got it on the next run. Uh, we're gonna do, um, we're going to have double bits, some of our single bits, like our 36 single, uh, some boys ax handles. I believe, I believe I've got the, the 19 HC, that long, thin hatchet handle. So pretty much ordered in, think we're getting in everything of our top sellers, uh, that you guys have been waiting for and all of that. So there's a lot more, um, we're getting a lot more in of the, of less models, basically. Like, you know, I think we've got 10 models coming in restock, even though we have over 50 handles. So, but yeah, 28 Fallers has been one that I've gotten a lot of requests, like, hey, when are we gonna get this back in stock? And so that'll be coming along with the Heritage 30C. And I don't know, we'll see on the 19. I don't know if the 19 is gonna hit the site on this batch. I don't think it will, but it, it probably will in uh, January sometime, I'm hoping, so. Yeah, that's the handle rundown. Download the app for the auction if you're not on the mobile app. It's gonna help make it so much easier to bid and so much easier to track that. And um, have patience with us with the clerking. It's just Dalton and I right now at that um, with that project. So yeah, that's Whiskey River Weekly. I appreciate your support. I appreciate uh, you guys allowing us to do what we do for a living. And uh, there'll be lots of new projects coming whether that's between the end of this year and into next year. And we're really excited to try to restructure this to um, fit your guys' needs and get more handles out. So anyway, be good, stay sharp, and uh, wave to your neighbor.